hey guys welcome back to another reading welcome back to my channel so today we are going to be seeing what's coming towards you throughout the rest of this month of october okay um and yeah we're just gonna get straight into it so but before we do get into it, you guys i do want to announce that i am offering 30 dollar personal readings okay um, and with these readings, you are able to ask as many questions as you want, okay? You you are able to ask an unlimited amount of questions, okay? This could be regarding love, career, finances. It could be about anything in general, okay? Whatever you guys want to know, whatever you guys want answers on, you can ask, okay? And I'm here to give you those answers, give you the clarity that you are looking for, okay? So if you guys are thinking about uh, purchasing that, you know, personal reading with me you can um just scroll down in my description box right underneath this video and all the details will be down there okay so let's get straight into it so this is a reading for my air signs okay gemini libra aquarius oh my gosh my dog is barking in the background y'all please excuse him okay i'm gonna try if he barks y'all i'm gonna try to talk as loud as i can over him okay I apologize. Okay, so let's see. Spirit, what's coming towards my air signs throughout the rest of this month? Oops. What's coming towards my air signs? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius throughout the rest of this month of October. What's going on for my air signs throughout the rest of this month of October 2022? air signs gemini libra aquarius what's going on for my air signs throughout the rest of this month okay so we're starting off with the five of cups okay so y'all could be dealing with the water sign cancer scorpio pisces okay it doesn't have to be it could be any sign but what i'm seeing here is that somebody here is feeling regret about sorry something that they've done okay somebody here is crying over spoiled milk because they feel guilty, regretful over something that they've done to you or something that, you know, that occurred, that they've caused. Somebody feels like they've caused something and they regret it, okay? Um, let's see, what else is coming up for my air signs? We have the Emperor. This could be an Aries, okay? I feel like this person is feeling really weak right now, you guys, because of, you know, they are, you know, um, they are recognizing the pain that they've caused in this relationship or they're recognizing something that they've done to you and now it's like they are trying to stay as strong as they can and be in their power with the emperor energy and be in control so that they could come come towards you with this energy if that makes any sense okay so like this person wants to be in control over you now okay they want to be more stronger okay they want to show you that they that they are strong enough and that they do, you know, that they do feel very strongly for you. Okay, we have judgment in the nine of swords. Exactly. So I feel like with this person here with the judgment card, they want to come towards you and ask you for a second chance because they know that they messed up. They know that they've caused you a lot of pain. They know that you've walked away from them. You moved on from them. You hurt them. I mean, they hurt you. Okay. And now it's like they feel regret and now they want to come back in, you know, being in their power to, you know, ask you for a second chance, ask you for forgiveness. Okay, like this person can't even sleep at night, y'all. This person is not sleeping at night, okay, because all they're thinking about is the things that they've done to you, okay? This person couldn't even receive some type of karma, okay? I feel like maybe that has also made them realize what they've done wrong in this relationship, in this connection, in this situation, and they regret it, okay? So, yeah, we got the Ace of Cups. So it's like this person knows that they have feelings for you. This person knows that they have love for you, which is why they are feeling this way. Because they know like they've hurt you and now it's like they regret it. And, you know, they just, they're realizing that they do have love for you and that they messed up. Okay. Um, With this four of cups here, but it's like at the same time, this person knows that you don't, that you may not even forgive them. Okay, you may not even accept this person back in. And with this page of swords, it's like all they could just think about is the pain that they've caused and 
all they could do is just watch you from afar okay like this person could also even be like stalking you heavily on social media you know um due to the distance between the two of you okay you guys are at a distance from each other and it's like this person is is keeping a very close eye on you from afar okay y'all this person is feeling very guilty about the things that they did to you okay it could be anything like this person could have said something to you they could have physically did something to you emotionally did something to you whatever it is they feel bad okay now it's like they're they feel sorry y'all like they want to come in and apologize to you for it okay they regret it show me more spirit for my air signs what's coming towards them i feel like this you could also be having like a new person coming towards you ace of cups this could be somebody new but somebody here feels stuck about making a decision or like coming forward. This could be the person or this could be somebody new. But I feel like somebody here is thinking about taking a step towards you, but they're kind of hesitant about it. We got the Queen of Wands. You guys are very attractive looking to this person. Okay, air signs. Y'all look really good to this person. And this could be a this could be another reason why they have a lot of guilt and regret because they're realizing your beauty. They're realizing your worth, okay? And they they feel like there is no one, no one like you. There's no other that compares to you. And it's like the more they think about this, y'all, the more they they feel like a fool for being the person that they were to you before, okay? Um, and yeah, I feel like this person hopes that you can forgive them, y'all. They hope that you can. Because look, the ten of ten of wands, the three of swords, the eight of cups, and the six of cups. Because they know like this is over. Okay, they have a feeling that you that you don't want to be with them, or it's over with, it's done with, it's done with. You guys are separated. There's no coming back together. This is how they feel, but they don't want it to be like this. They don't want you to walk away from them. They don't want you guys to not speak to each other, not talk to each other. You know, they don't like that. They don't want that. They don't feel comfortable in this situation right now where you two are at odds with each other okay they are aware that you two went through some things but they don't like that there is a distance between the two of you right now okay which is why they want to come in um and which is why they want to ask you for some type of forgiveness okay with the six of cups it's like they all they could do is just think about how much they have feelings for you how much they miss you they think about you like this person can't stop thinking about you you know, um, and I feel like the distance between the two of you is definitely like making it hard for them. It's killing them inside that you guys aren't talking or I don't know, like you guys haven't seen each other. There's something. OK, there could be an emotional distance, a physical distance between the two of you. But whatever distance is there, you guys, this person is not happy about it. OK, um, they're hurt. They're, they may act like they're not hurt. They may act like everything's OK, but it's a facade they they are not okay y'all okay like they cannot it's like they can't live without you or something like that like they're going crazy without you right now is what i'm getting here okay like they feel heartbroken they feel it's like a burden to them that that you two are at a distance from each other you know and it's like all they could do right now is just watch you on social media or just think about you from afar and because they feel like they can't get any access to you, but they want to come in to, you know, talk to you, communicate with you, to text you, call you. But they have a little bit of a fear, okay, that, you know, maybe something will not go right or, you know, that you may reject them or something like that. But they hope that you, you can accept whatever they want to offer you. And, you know, because they do have a lot of attraction for you. They do have a lot of love for you. Um, and they want to come in and make this right here, okay, y'all? Like, they really do. They have a lot of love for y'all, okay? Um, so, yeah, this is the energy that I was picking up for you guys' reading today, you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this reading. I know it was short, but I'm pretty sure you guys got the message, okay? If this resonated with you, make sure you give this video a like, all right? Um, and if you guys are new here, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. And if you guys are thinking about that $30 personal reading, go ahead in my description box below and purchase one right now, okay? See y'all later.